Oh, this is so annoying. Oh, what the, and Like, that yellow thing has to be there no matter what. That kind of narrows it down. Yes. Okay, one more. And there we go. Nothing. Oh. Is in this where we uh, meet Zeke again? The guy with his hands cut up. Tripwire. Oh, I remember this. I came so close to getting killed last time on my first go. This mini game. Hopefully, uh, hopefully, I'll be able to beat the best time if I'm fast enough. There's an it. Oh, stop doing that. Yeah, that's it. Or not. Oh my god. Okay, I'm. I'm oh, this can't get nerve wracking. Yes! Oh, that was actually pretty close. One. I wish the door was by here instead. Because, you know, see, it would save you having to wait for the wall to open back up so far. Okay, it's far. Where is it? Alright. I'm sure I would go that one. Yeah. Okay, so this is where we like meet Zero again. And this is the bit where I fail like tons of times before. Hello? 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 Alright, just hang on. And on my last playthrough, I was always questioning how were you supposed to know what valve to turn. Like, there was no way of telling. But it um, turns out, you could just go, like, you know, look at the pipes and follow them. And you see that's, like, right next to her, so you better not, uh, better not, like, you know, rotate that. It's kind of cheap how the steam is blasting off down there. Because, like, it took me ages to realise I could even, like, reach the lad without getting killed. I gotta mix, do a dial puzzle or something by you, haven't I? The blue one. It's which is really similar to the you know pipe puzzles from the first game. In a good way, I mean. It's kind of like how they reuse the Manders trap puzzle, but like, uh, okay, all right, I, I'm done. Never mind. I think that's it. Oh we just gotta pull this valve and then we're done. And then I think that's when we meet Zeke again. All oh, right, I can climb down you. Right, this is definitely where one of them are. It must be, because I know for for a fact I didn't go down you last time. It's got to be something you. What's this do? Absolutely nothing. Right, let's move on.
How did I not think to go down here in my last playthrough? Why are you kidding? There's nothing here. This is a perfect place to hide something. What? They really should have put something down here. It was a, like, you know, a pretty good place to hide some stuff. Uh, not even one, like, puzzle piece. Ah, that's disappointing. I got my hopes up there. It's kind of annoying having to wait for these doors to open all the time. I think they're, they're pretty much loading screens actually. Kind of like the elevators in Mirror's Edge. It's to make you think that you're still playing the game but it's pretty much just a loading screen. And by the way I, I am not like, a, I'm not a game developer of Mirror's Edge or any crap like that. I'm, I'm just assuming that they're loading screens because they seem like it. Because you spend like five minutes inside the elevators. Which like, it's just, you really don't need to. It's just really annoying. Oh, I really wish I would find another puzzle piece. I haven't found a single one. Which I had in the way to go. Gotta find, make that bomb again. But of course, you gotta find the uh, things to make it. So there's that poison gas room. So, oh, come on, there must be something hidden by you. Nope. Ah, there's got to be something by you. There just has to be. Yes! We look of that, my first uh, puzzle piece, which I hadn't got before. Only four left. That was a pretty clever place to hide there. Like, I didn't even know you could move that on my first playthrough. I didn't even notice this, uh, that little uh, trolley thing, or whatever you want to call it. I think that's it in this area. Oh. I might be able to do this puzzle without having to climb up that ladder again. I think the circle was like somewhere by you. Something like that, I think. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Yes! Oh, come on. I have got a good memory. Right. Wait, wait, wait. Something to pick up. Case file. Yeah, I, yeah I've, I've, I had that before, yeah. I know you go in that room later. Come on, only four case files. And it's a, like, pretty small game. I really don't know where they can hide them. Right, let's do this bit. Need to find a couple of the use the on the mini game. Right, there we go. A 
god. Actually. I wish your health bar, well, heart monitor thing would show up while you're doing this. So you have no idea how close to death you are. Right, there we go. Use this. Right, let's just check through here. Please, please be a puzzle piece or something. Are you joking? The floor is covered in glass where I was crawling. Nothing. Puzzle piece, which I've already got. That's it. Oh well. I don't think it's fair to put a glass there. He asking. I guess he's asking me because I've got a platinum on the game. Alright, there's got to be a case file or something up here. It just has to be. I've checked every single corner up to this point of the game. Another one, not another one. I'm just gonna do what I did last time with uh, Henry since I just got lucky and then all of a sudden I did it. Next thing I knew, wait a minute. I think there's a yes. There you go. If you if you um if you're stuck on lights out, just randomly hit every button possible. You might just get lucky. All right, let's see what this guy asked again. Project purity. Um. I can't remember where that was. I can't remember what you do. Unless that was like that little virtual, no, yeah. Like that virtual city thing. With that girl is asking you to do stuff. You could just Google it, but then asking me. Is that, is it that little girl giving you missions? You. Basically, just do what she says, I think. Well, that, well that's if Project Purity is what I'm thinking. Oh, where the hell did he come from? No! I hit the wrong button. No! 